this is the bracket I was on about. We drilled four holes, and it was, it was that's what I was cleaning yesterday. We just galvanised it. Uh, we welded this bracket on. This is what it's a bit like this, but that one's knackered. You push it onto there, the gill break of a tube. Uh, it's going to go to the other pillar now, and um, put put that on and see how far past because uh, they didn't have enough enough drop. And it's 16 foot wide this as well and that's just over 16 foot so looks all right that doesn't it tidy job because that one's a bit low and the wind was going in howling behind the gill breaker but now with this it's a, we've moved it a bit higher to give it a bit more cover that cover crops come well right tall good growing weather I oh, see, when did we put that in? It was a few weeks ago. About three weeks ago we drilled that. So it's quite, this is the shortest bit further up there, it's real tall. Just checking out our pigs. Morning guys, Wednesday morning. Uh, I've come in a little bit earlier today. I've just seen Mike, that's our fieldsman. Um, he comes and checks the pigs. Um, every so often just to make sure if they're, he, he's the one who does the medication for us descri uh, subscribes it for us um, I'm just checking the outdoor pigs now I was just showing that cover crop there it's come really well I'll just flip you around I can't remember what was in this mix but it's, it's doing really well been good conditions though it's been wet so it's had plenty of water and the sun's out. Bloody sunny today. Well, next week it looks like a corker. So I've just checked all pigs. Uh, there's one, two, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven troughs, one lid's fallen down to feed today. Just getting some food out of this bin because that, that other bin's empty, so we just uh, we've got six. Well, I showed you seven, seven troughs to feed. But goodbye, this but uh, this um, conveyor. Got it from the art machinery sale. Morning, guys. Friday morning. Can't remember. Is it twenty second of June? 23rd of June, something like that, I don't really know. Uh, we've been around checked everywhere. We've booked, booked the scrape throughout, um, bedded it up. Uh, we've take, closed the kennels off, uh, that sheeting for the kennel on both sides. You can't see that one. It's a bit there. There it is there. Um, Cause it's getting a lot warmer. Once it gets a little bit warmer, we'll take the boards off uh, the Yorkshire boarding just to let a bit more air flow in when it gets a bit warmer, but it, it seems a bit cool now. So, uh, next job will be to go check the wiener shed, because um, my dad said there was a couple of uh, sick pigs in there, so I'm going to go and have a look, um, go see if they want jabbing or whatever. Um, then we're back on to finish renovating the, the guilt yard into the, the, the wiener house. We've got quite a lot done yesterday. We've got all the gates stock boarded and up. Uh, so today there'll be a big blocking to do and deciding what to do with one of the sides, whether to put a gill breaker there or Yorkshire boarding. I still don't know, uh, but we'll, uh, we'll decide that a bit later on. Right, we'll go get some jobs done. Shed update. I think I've shown you that gate there. We did that other day. We finished this off yesterday. The main gate and the little gate to keep them in here when we scrape through when we need muck it out we did this gate yesterday as well uh, but so today we're gonna start blocking this wall here it's gonna be about four high there obviously i think i only need to do another two courses there so that side won't take too long i just need to go put a mix on now obviously gill breakers up look at that sun it's beautiful I need to get combine out as well. I keep saying it, um, get combine out, but I haven't had a chance. But she's coming along nicely. 
Uh, I just need fixed and engineering to get me drinkers and I can put them up um, and my feeder in here. And uh, we're, we're about there. I'm no blocky or bricklayer, but I'm quite happy with that. I know it's not perfect, but it's, it's only a retaining wall. I'll flip you around and show you. Like I say, I'm no bricky, but it's not too bad. See, that, that, that metal girder there, we're going to put down there in between this gap here, then blocking in between here to give it more strength. Then we've got hooks on there to put, put a gate on here or a door, so when we walk in, but we're going to go with gill breaker, I think. So, but yeah, I'm happy with that. It's the first time I've blocked and it, it's not too bad, is it? I've only got to do one more course. I would say one more course and it'd be done. Won't go any higher than that. Because it's only for wean pigs, you see. Right, guys, just got that wall finished. Well, it was a bit of a nightmare because... Um, oh, that shutter in the way. Let me just move that. Uh, when I, I built the wall, I did about three, two courses. I brought this gate round and it hit. If I want a gap, so you see a gap there now. If I want a gap there before, so I had to move it all inwards. But yeah, looks all right. I'm quite happy with it, even though I'm not a, like I say, a bricky. Put this post in as well. Then well, there was a bit of a step down here, so we've just concreted it in. Um, as you do when you always write your name in it, don't you, when you've done something like this? We'd had to put his name in it as well. So, yeah, I'm happy with it. It's taken a while, though. Um, we've got all that to do there, like I say, but it's coming on now. At least we've got a little doorway there. I just got a bit of all this to tidy up, sweep. So it's all clear, because once we build a wall, it'd be out a bit harder to get to. Just walking to the outdoor pigs. Um, I'm just fading up. Friday afternoon, I've done, done scrape through. That cover crop looks amazing. It's flowering lovely now. There's bear panting. It's bloody hot today. It feels like 25 degrees. That blue sky. I bet the pigs are digging. But he were dead then, just sleeping. They're getting covered in mud to protect themselves from sun. It's like uh, sun cream, mud to them. They're trying to stay cool under the water trough. him sat in all that mud. There's Red. You right, Red? What are you doing? Backs are open. Hello. Right, guys, that's Friday done and dusted. Um, it's been a busy week getting this building sorted. Um, yeah, there's not much stuff to do now. I feel like I haven't filmed much this week because there's not been much going on. <laughs> Just with pig's side and with um, with this new building, there's not much going on, like. But hopefully, in the next couple of weeks, we're going to be spraying off the, the the winter barley. So we should be. I was talking to the the Sam who walks our crops. Um, he was saying maybe over Yorkshire Show week. Yeah, so it's like, I think, is it, is it the 10th of July, something like that? So that's when we could be cutting. So I'll get plenty of filming of that. Um, just, uh, yesterday was my two sons' sports day, so I was there yesterday at the school. So, yeah, this, this week's just f flown back. I can't believe how much... We've got a lot done with that shit. I'm real pleased how much we've got done. We've probably got about two days left of finishing it off, and it's done. Um mm. Definitely need to get combine out next week and get it, so well not service but look over, make sure everything's working right. But apart from that, guys, it's been quite a boring video. Video today, um, there's not much going on. I haven't really filmed much this week either. So 
I hope you enjoy it anyway. Um, yeah, well, I'll see you on the next one. Have a good one, guys. Yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps my channel out, guys. Have a good weekend.